Today I am going to explain how works runtime IP in the hub proxy and hub proxy v2. Uh, runtime IP allows us to change the settings real time without downtime and restarting the loading of the hub proxy series. Uh, let's see. For example, we want to disable um, any front end or back end server, for example. Let's see status of them. Okay, for example, test 18. Status open. Let's disable type front end test 18. Enter. How is it now? Uh, it stop. There is a more convenient uh, options. It set through the stats page. Just enable or disable. Oh, for front end, it doesn't work, <laughs> but work for uh, the backend servers. Okay, let's enable it back. It's enabled. Uh, but there is one problem. Uh, the changes doesn't save in the config file. If we change here something, with the next restart, it will be disappear. What can cause problems with debugging and confusing us when runtime have has one config and config file uh, has another settings. Uh, to avoid these problems, Haproxy we offer you uh, the opportunity to use its interface, which work with uh, Haproxy runtime. Uh, it will edit runtime configuration and saves change in the config file. For example, uh, let's look at the Markstron. We have how many? Three, four, three, two, one for backend test. Now let's choose backend test 18. Let's see what, what's in config file, what we have in config file. Open. Just in test. Three, two, one. Okay, let's type one, two, three, enter. One strong for test has been set to one, two, three. Let's see. One, two, three. Let's see in the config file. Let's start one, two, three. It and it uh, happens without restarting and saves in, in your config file. Of course, it saves also uh, a version file, which have these um, changes. If, for example, if you want to roll back on another file, the config file. And also here works uh, master-slave master behavior. It means, uh, if you have made change on the master server, the change will take effect on the slave server too. It will break it on convenient. And that's all. Thank you. And use Hubroxy.